he is anxious, angry. He feels tremendous loss and guilt. It's like a pirate had a baby with an angel. Wow. It's a real wake-up call for me. OK, I'm going to get a Bowflex. I'm going to commit. I'm going to get some dumbbells. You know you can't eat dumbbells, right? It's like his muscles are made of katati metal fibers. Stop massaging his muscles. Wake him up. So Chris Pratt, and that scene is is very, very funny. Chris Pratt has been telling people that you fed him uh, kangaroo meat. Is that true? <laughs> yeah, I didn't physically feed him. You didn't so actually spoon it he's, to him? He's, uh, <laughs> no, I would have liked to. I would have. <laughs> uh, I got some kangaroo meat for him, and we he cooked did. it, and we marinated it, and he You didn't. cooked it yourself? No, I gave it to the chef. Oh, you see. <laughs> I, I said I did. But it, uh, it's, it's quite delicious. And he kind of, for days, until actually last week, was like, it wasn't kangaroo meat, was it? I'm like, it was, it was, it was. So he thought you were kidding. He thought I was and, kidding. But it was kangaroo meat. 100 percent Yeah, they eat yeah. I didn't even know people ate kangaroos. I guess it makes sense. You yeah. eat anything that's there. There's, there's, there's anything there. that kicks you in the face, you'd probably <laughs> Yeah, eat. you punch it back and then you know. You know. <laughs> what was it like socially, the social scene on the set with all of these actors? Was everybody hanging out? Or did people go their own way? Was there right, yeah. kind of a community thing? I don't know. I I, I don't really get them. Invited to think. I don't, I don't, I'm not on the group text or anything. I did get invited one time at a at a pub crawl the Russos were having in Atlanta, but I was shooting this movie, I Tanya, and then I showed up. Oh yeah. You and, were great in that movie, by the thank way. Thank you, man. I didn't even but, realize it was you until after. Well, not the the day. Because because I stood there for 15 minutes and no one came up to me. I realized they didn't even recognize who I was. I literally didn't know it until just now. <laughs> I swear to God, I swear to God. I swear on my children, I didn't see. I can't tell. I don't know. Wow. The truth. But anyway, yeah, they came, they were like, how is that little movie of yours? <laughs> I was like, it's good. Yeah, well, that turned out to be a pretty good little movie there. It's crazy. It's true. Do you, um, it's true. Do you ever, do you, you don't get recognized from your character at all, do you? Funnily enough, no. Yeah. Um, I'm not bald or blue. No. <laughs> but you know who I get recognized as a lot recently? Sophie Turner from Game of Thrones. Oh, really? <laughs> and there was one time when I was really, really tired, and I was coming home from work, shooting with all the prosthetics, and this guy was like, oh, my God, I love you, an X-Men. And I was like, thank you so much. <laughs> I just couldn't deal with it. I was like, OK, I'm just going to say thanks and then scuttle away. But then I got caught in this conversation, and then I got so deep into it, I was like, I can't tell him I'm lying now. <laughs> and so I didn't know what to do, so I physically ran away. And I'm sorry if he thinks that Sophie Turner is a really weird person now. <laughs> Yeah, you could really damage her reputation. I'm so you? sorry, Sophie. <laughs> Josh, were you isolated from the rest of the group playing the Like film? right now? Like right now. <laughs> I put you as far away as possible. I bet. I'm Did in my own Did you feel uh, left out in any way? Was, was there any kind of that, that deal where the good guys stay away from the bad guy? I don't know. I, you know, I always feel uncomfortable, so I think you'll have to ask these guys whether they feel attracted to me or not. <laughs> He's, he's, pretty, pretty, he's attractive. pretty attractive. He's yeah. pretty attractive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Maybe it's so attractive they get embarrassed. It's like when you see a pretty girl and you don't know what to say because you don't know if you live up to it. Like a Trump and Macron, really, yeah. you know? Right. Similar yeah. thing going on there. Yeah. Okay, so you guys are, um, we can't say anything about what happened in the movie, obviously. Um, we, you guys now know what did happen in the movie. Do you have any idea what happens in the next movie? <laughs> <laughs> We're talking about this one. Idea? Idea. Because I have to say, I, I'm, uh, I can tell that there's genuine surprise mm -hmm. amongst the cast at, as far as the movie itself. And it just makes me wonder how you made another two plus hour movie if <laughs> the ending of the first one or what happens in the first one is a surprise. I haven't seen it yet, so I don't know what happened. Some of us are excited about the next one. Some of you are excited. <laughs> That makes me happy. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a spoiler, right?
Thanks for watching. If you liked that video, click the subscribe button. And if you didn't like it, well, you hurt my feelings.